Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel. Today I'm going to be shopping my stash for some new palettes for my makeup basket for the week. Last week I had a great big bunch of colors that I used and this week I'm going to pull in a little bit of a different manner. I hope you enjoy this video and if you do, please remember to give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. See you soon. Okay, so what I'm going to do this week is I am going to pull a collection of things from my drawer. And I have certain things, like I have my um, ABH palettes right here. I have my Too Faced palettes all right here. I have tons of um, Too Faced palettes. And then these are all of my Urban Decay palettes outside of my, I have a couple specialty palettes. Um, and then this right here. This front section here is Lorac. And so I think that what I'm going to do this week is because I have my Juvia's Place palettes upstairs and I use them all the time, I'm talking all the time, I am going to pull my Urban Decay Naked palettes. And that's what I'm going to have for this week. I'm just going to pull the whole lot of them. I have the Urban Decay 1. And this is a very, very beautiful palette. I'm going to pull this one. I'm going to pull the number two palette. This one is so difficult for me to open. I won't even try right now. Ugh, this one's the same. Let me put this down. And I'm going to pull the number three because it's absolutely gorgeous. I love this palette. And I'm pulling Smoky. I am going to pull the Naked Cherry and the Naked um, Heat. These are both, well, I'll open the Heat because it's my favorite. <laughs> the Naked Cherry is beautiful too, but this is just my favorite. Look at that. Okay, so I'm going to pull all of these colors and I'm going to try to get some new looks out of them in connection with my rotation palettes that I keep upstairs at my vanity. So this is a total of six palettes that I'm going to pull for today, for this week. And again, this is going to be in connection with my other palettes. Oh, wait a minute. This one right here belongs to this set as well. This um, Naked Basics. So I'll pull this one as well. And I think this will be fun just to use all of the palettes in a collection all together. Because generally speaking, when things are put out, they are put out in collections, even if they're released at different times. So when you use the colors together, sometimes you just get a full idea or scope of what the um the company was actually going for so i am going to use all of these together and then maybe next time i'll do my larger palettes that have the colors in it like this one right here is pastels this one right here is bright beautiful colors this is i just pulled this one that's why i didn't go with these first but these are all really beautiful bright colors um this palette right here i think i would absolutely love with the rest of the naked palettes but um, I tell you, this was a palette that I used every single day when I got it. And then I used it so often that when it went on sale on the Sephora website, I ordered another one. So I have two of these right here. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, so these are my palettes that I will be pulling. I do think that I want to pull a blush palette for this week. And I think I'll just pull my Smashbox blush palette. And yeah, this is going to work out well because I will show you my inspiration picture for this week. It is Gabrielle Union and she has on an extremely nude look that she with a smoky eye. And I think that that's something that I'm just going to try to really um, get into the zone of just really getting that down really quickly and easily. And I know that one of the things that I love to use as a blush is the combination of these two right here. And that gives me a really nice, soft, glowy look, and it doesn't give me much color. And so I know this will be great for the look that I'm going for. And I think I will pull my Laura Geller Gilded Honey. You can see this is definitely a pan. Let me open this up. Look at that. And I tell you, you have to love a, a palette. You have to love a color when you have when you hit pan on a highlighter. I love this, but I also use it as eyeshadow, and that's why it is where it is right now. <laughs> okay, so um, I think that will be it that I will pull by way of palettes. I was thinking about pulling this MAC palette again 
because I think this right here will go well with um, what I'll be going for this week, this color and this color right here, because these give me such a nice glow, but it's a nice nudie kind of a glow. See how beautiful that is? Yeah, I think I will pull this. I'll put that into rotation. And then this color here is just so pretty to go with my smoky eye. See how gorgeous they are? So I will pull these as well. That one as well. Okay, so here we are. I am fully stocked this week. I have all of my palettes over here. I guess I can move these around. Try to fit everything in nice and snugly so it's not so chaotic. And like I said, I do pull quite a few palettes each week. But what I do is I just pull out all of the colors and I just play with them all out, all out on my desk at one time. Put those two there. So this is my beauty box for the week and I hope you enjoyed this video. Please let me know if you pulled any of the Urban Decay Naked palettes for this week or if you have any of the same rotation palettes that I have, namely the Juvia's Place. I'll talk to you again soon, guys. Bye.